guys, this is JB3 and we are back with another episode of FIFA 20 Career Mode Youth Edition featuring Scunthorpe United. And we are here in the beginning of November. We will take on Tottenham. It will be a big, big test. They are number two on the table, but we are only three points off being top of the table. Obviously, goal differential, we probably won't win out on, but... To be in this position this early, it is a good, good spot to be in. We've done well against these top teams, so hopefully we can continue our run. We have a little international break, and then we'll get into a game against Wolves. But let's get started. It's a big one here against Tottenham. So we'll get into this one here against Tottenham. We'll go with our same starting lineup. Marchenko out on the left, so we'll get him some playing time. Or I guess playing time that he thinks he needs, but either way, we'll have him start there. Segura on the bench still. Hopefully we can make him happy. We'll get him out into the game. Let's get started here, see if we can grab three points. And we'll get this one underway. Wang has the ball, gets it out wide to Bailey. Bailey's going to push forward here. Can he get around his man? No, not quite fast enough. Holds up, lays it in there. Can he get it behind for Kinsaysa? No, it's a big block away. Goes for a throw in. Wang in the midfield, finds George Wood. He'll try to get it back to Wang. Wang now on to Kinsaysa. Has it. Oh, couldn't get the shot off on a heavy touch. And Kinsaysa had a chance there. Oh, but what a blown opportunity there for Scunthorpe United early. Allen that keeps it in. Now looking for Marchenko. Marchenko sends it along, looking for Wang. He'll run onto it. Can he find it into the box? Looking for something. Looking for maybe Kinsaysa. Can he find him? No, it's going to be punched away. Manalik back quick with it. Manalik has a chance. George Wood takes the shot, but it's going to be saved. it along Manalik. Manalik through the middle. Back up to Kinsaysa. Kinsaysa drops it off. George Wood gets around his man. It's a tight angle. He'll take the shot anyway. Looking for a deflection and Wang couldn't find it. Jackson wide to Awazi. He'll poke it free. Gets it down to Bailey. Bailey now sends a good cross. Looking for George Wood. Had him there. Oh and it goes wide of the net. Couldn't get the right side of the head and Oh, man, another chance missed for Scunthorpe United. Manalik moves it along Wang. Wang tries to beat a defender. Has to go wide now to Marchenko. Marchenko cuts back inside nicely. Around two defenders. Off to Wang. Wang through to Bailey. Takes a strike right on the keeper, though. Alan Vick out wide. Final minutes. Drops it in behind. Looking for Wang. He won't be able to get it. And will they blow full time? They will. And we'll go in. It's been all Scunthorpe United. Multiple shots on there. But a big job by the Tottenham keeper. Keeps us out. It's nil-nil. Bailey pushing forward. Up to Kinsesa. Gets it up. George Wood. George Wood now. Looking for that run from Wang. Taps along to him. Can he do it? No. Has to cut back. Back into Marchenko. He'll take a strike from the top of the box. But maybe took a step too long. And it gets into the defender. And he's going to be able to knock that one away for a corner. I'm going to push forward here. Gets it up to Kinsesa. Can he drive forward? No. Into George Wood. George Wood. One-on-one -on -one with the defender. Top of the box. Can he find a lane? Oh, no. We're going to go well wide. Trying to get around that defender. And couldn't do it. Analik goes all the way up to George Wood. George Wood now looking to push forward. Can he find something in the middle? Has Kinsesa. Has Guzman on his left. Lays it off to him. Into the box. Cuts back. Has a lane. Takes the... Oh, right on the keeper again is Guzman. And another good chance saved by Tottenham. Harry Kane fights off. Lays it off. Kinsesa can't break it up. Back out wide for Lukaku. Wazi misses. <laughs> takes the shot side netting. And that might be the real first dangerous offensive chance Tottenham's had. And it's a good one, but luckily, wide of the net. Alan Vick moves it along. Segura, he's going to push forward, holds up now, centers it here to Guzman. Guzman, can he move it along? Can say so. Behind his man, takes the strike, and he finds it into the bottom corner. Oh, when we finally break through, 88th minute. Can say so. Gets it here from Guzman. A nice little build up here, and we finally beat the keeper near post it goes in it's going to be one to nil scunthorpe united on top here in the final stages of the game 
Final build up here, it's a chance. They get behind a Segura there. Can he cut him off? Final minutes into the box, takes the shot deflected. And we will finish this game on a corner kick here for Tottenham. They'll look to send it into the box. It's gonna be Lukaku. He's gonna send it in. He's gonna have a chance. It's gonna be knocked away. Gonna to go to Harry Kane, rolls out for another corner. And dying minutes here. We'll have a chance. Can we get this one just cleared out of the box? It's back in. Bicycle. Yidget saves. Boots it long. It's a 1-0 victory to Scun Thorpe United. What a beauty it was. I mean, we deserve this one. This is unbelievable. Let's take a look at the shots here as we absolutely silence Harry Kane. Nine shots, five on target. It felt like it was even more than that. It was just Tottenham launching crosses into the box and we dealt well. Can say so gets an 8.1, George Wood a 6.7, Wang a 7.4, Marchenko a 7.2, Bailey 6.8, Yidget 7.4, Awazi 6.8, Hung a 6.9, Jackson 7.8, Allenvik a 7.0, Richter 6.3, Manalek a 7.2, Guzman an 8.0, Segura 6.8, Can say so 8.1, and that does it. It's a 1 0 victory over Tottenham. So Seisman is still the best player, and do we really need another midfielder? Probably not. He's still going to be below a 60, so I think we're going to pass here in our final month in Poland. So Joseph McMahon is going to be the best player. Again, we just have a lot of midfielders at this point. We're probably looking for more wingers, which we'll probably do on our next scout report. So we will move on here in Ireland. So we have two players that we will bring in here in England. It's Hugh Mason, 74 to 94, 50 to 70 overall. And then we have a striker in here somewhere. Here he is, Harrison Rose, 53 to 65, 75 to 91, 6'3". You know, he's got a lot of time to grow, so I don't mind bringing him into the academy. So we will send our scouts back out. It will be Czech Republic for a winger, Germany for any, and Belgium for any. And we'll take a look at the academy. Brian Park coming along well, 63 overall. Oscar Thomas looking good. He is going to be one player to watch for sure. We have Osagawa, Vergara still looking good. Thomas Evans has fallen off a little bit, but the overall is still there, so we'll hold on to him. Maybe he can find a cup squad. Same thing with Henry Sadami. We'll hold on, and you know if they don't make it in this year, we'll, we'll probably let him go. We have a few other players to take a look at. Yasin Ayman still looking good. Good at a, yeah, I could probably play center back. Harrison Rose, who we just brought in, 56 overall. Mark Ennis looking good, 66 overall. So a lot, again, a lot of midfielders. Hugh Mason, 63 overall, will round it out. Looking good here at 6'5", goalkeeper. So unfortunately, Oscar Jackson on international duty gets hurt and he pulls a hamstring, gone for two months. So we'll get into this game against Wolves. It will be the one change. Dave Frazier comes in at center back. I think he actually came in last year too for Oscar Jackson when he went down. So he'll, you know, we got a lot of training into him. We'll see how he does here in the Premier League. Let's hope he can hold on here while Jackson recovers. And we'll get this one underway. Oh, it's a chance here. Wolves will look to send it across. No, they don't. They pass it back. Drive the edge of the box. Awazi overruns it. Manalik tries to slow him down, and Yiji has to make a big save to get this game underway. Four minutes in. It's out wide. Awazi. Oh, Bailey slips and falls out of position now. Has a chance. Awazi lays off his man, goes in across, and Yiji will tap it over the bar. Wazi moves it up, has Kinsesau, moves it through Wang. Wang, in on net, finds the back of it. Top corner here for Scunthorpe United, our first offensive chance, and it finds the back of it. And Oh boy, do we love an early lead. It lets us play a little bit more free. That's a nice pass there. Kinsesau finds it. He gets caught ball watching, and Wang finds it into the back of the net. We're on a top one nil early here against Wolves. Marchenko moves it up, can say so, on the ball again. He has a chance, drives in. Can he find Wang in the middle? Takes it. Oh, ho, ho. what a shot that was. 
Wang sends a rocket at the keeper, but he's got his hand on it. He's going to knock it away and keep it for a corner. Corner here. We got big Dave Frazier in the middle. Can we find him? No, it's Alan Vick who takes a shot but gets deflected. Oh, big shot from the top of the box, and Yuji handles it well. The long-range shot gets knocked out for a corner kick. Manalik looking for a long ball, looking for George Wood. George Wood gets on the end of it, driving into the box. Takes maybe one too many touches, a tough angle, and the keeper keeps him out. They lay it off here. Dave Frazier has to do a good job here. They lay it off. Can we break it up? Marchenko couldn't do it. Frazier back into pressure. Knocks it away, and it goes into halftime. 1-0, Scunthorpe United on top. Out wide, cross goes in, Manalik handles it, sends it back to the top though, dangerous, Sanchez, Wang couldn't get there, big shot, and you get a hand to it, closes down that corner, sends it away. Loose ball in the middle, poked away, goes to Conceição, can he push forward, has a chance here, looking for Bailey or George Wood, he's going to go wide to Bailey. Bailey with some space, can he find a cross in there, looking for Marchenko on the header, oh what a beaut. What a beaut. I, mean, I thought that was going over Conceição and basically out for a throw-in. But Marchenko comes flying into the box. Oh, my God. Racing all the way back. They don't find him. They don't pick him up. And long-range header into the back of the net. It's 2-0. Guzman through to George Wood. Go wide to Bailey again. Bailey, can he find something for himself now? Drives into the box. No. Cuts back. Gets in front of it. In the middle, it's Hugh Davies who puts a big shot right on the keeper. Segura has it here, pushes along George Wood. George Wood, can he find it back for Segura? Segura right there, oh, rattles the post. George Wood can't get on the rebound, and it's controlled by Wolves. And that will do it. It's a 2-0 victory. Back-to-back -back clean sheets here for Scunthorpe United, and they are starting to take on the league. Look at this, seven shots, six on target. We didn't even let Wolves have any shots. They had a lot of possession though, but just weren't able to do anything with it. It's Conceição, 8.4, Marchenko, an 8.2, Yijit, 7.3, Oazi, 7.3, Hung, 7.1, Frazier, 7.1, Allenvik, 7.5, Bailey, 8.3, Manlik, 7.6, Davies, a 6.4, Segura, 6.5, Guzman, 6.3, George Wood, a 7.0, Wang, an 8.2, and that does it. It's a 2-0 victory. So that'll do it for us here in this one. And with the two victories, we see ourselves right up there into the third position, only two points behind Chelsea. And you know what? Goal differential, not the best, but we are doing the job keeping the ball out of the back of the net. We aren't scoring a ton, but hopefully when we get a chance to play some of these smaller teams, we'll have a chance to get some more balls in and kind of make that up because we have played a lot of the top teams. But that'll do it for us here in this one. If you did enjoy it, make sure to hit the subscribe button, turn on notifications so you always know when the newest episodes are coming out. And until next time, have a good one.